<laughs> spotter Clayton so, Hughes. Yeah, Martin's <laughs> trying to calm down his spotter. Oh, my gosh. Listen, you don't think everybody on this team gets emotionally involved in everything that goes on out there? Absolutely, man. A lot on the line for every right. one of these guys. I want to see what the one and the 41 do from the third <laughs> row. Do either of them push somebody into a position to jump out and take the lead? Mike, I'd watch that two-car, Brad yeah. Keselowski in fourth. This is where this race was won in overtime a year ago. Kurt Busch restarted in the outside of row two and four. Yeah, I don't think from the fifth position or sixth position you can win it, but from this second row, if Brad Keselowski gets a great start and kind of fakes Kevin Harvick, he could easily be three wide as they go into turn one. All right, Daniel Suarez got the free pass. 26 lead lap cars. Here we go. That's going to be Cole Custer to the outside of Brad Keselowski, putting him three wide. He got a push for Matt Benedetto. Can he stay in it in that upper groove? Here comes Kevin Harvick back to the outside of the, our leader, Mark, or, uh, Martin Truex Jr. Look at the run oh, that Custer they can, has. They touch. Here comes Custer. He had a big run down the back, down the straightaway. How did Mark Truex Jr. get to the outside of the four car, Kevin Harvick? Here comes Blaney to the inside, three wide. Custer White to the flag. outside, four wide. White flag waves, one to go, sponsored by Credit One Bank. Next flag ends it. They're banging off one another. Custer to the lead. Oh, heavy tire rub on the four car, Kevin Harvick. A rookie is going to win Kentucky. Can you believe it? I never would have believed it till now, Mike. Custer, Truex, DiBenedetto, Harvick, Blaney. Wow. Off the final turn. Rookie Cole Custer wins Kentucky. Can you believe it? Incredible. Incredible. That last restart, I can't wait to go back and watch this. That's going to put Cole Custer in the all-star race for Wednesday. That is all but unbelievable. You saw the stat a moment ago. Eric Jones, sixth place finish, the only time a rookie has finished at this tough, tough racetrack oh, in the top dead. 15. <laughs> Can you believe it? That was the best part I've ever driven, Mike. Hey, this place is my track, man. Me and David, we got this place figured out. <laughs> he certainly has that final restart figured out. Take him four wide. Cole Custer for Gene Haas and Tony Stewart. Crew Chief Mike Shiplett. Andy Houston, the spotter. What a restart and what a shootout. I saw Stewart Haas Ford winning this race, my man. It wasn't going to be Cole Custer for a long time until that last restart. Big celebration going on here for this young rookie. So the Quaker State 400 goes to the rookie who last week had his best career finish, fifth at Indianapolis, and only his second career top ten. Now he's won here before in Xfinity. Now Cole Custer is a NASCAR Cup Series winner. Woo! <laughs> Jamie. Cole Custer's entire team running out in this moment. They can't help themselves but to celebrate. They've got their masks on, but their young rookie driver just took it to victory lane on that final restart. Cole, a rookie, you are a winner in the Cup Series. What just happened on that restart? How good was that car? Man, we were, we were so good all day. Our car was so good. I mean, obviously, it wasn't the easiest track to pass. Hans Urkan stuck back there, but that was the best car I've ever driven in my life. Uh, everybody at SHR brought, brought an unbelievable car. I mean, Mike and Davin on the box, I mean, that was unbelievable. I mean, Gene, I can't stress enough how thankful I am for him taking a shot at me. It definitely was not the start of the year that we wanted. I mean, we were definitely way off at some places, but this, I mean, this was by far, I mean, 
unbelievable car. We put it all together, and I, I just can't thank everybody enough. Cole, typically for a rookie, it takes about three years to get to victory lane. Describe what it's like for a rookie, especially right now. You don't even get practice in these cars. Yeah, I mean, it's not easy. I mean, it's definitely you got to kind of adapt as much as you can. And I think we've gotten better and better at that, but um, it's just – it's just unbelievable. I mean, I, I didn't think that we were coming here, going coming to win. I mean, now we're going to be in the all-star race. I don't even have to run the Open. So, I don't know. Hopefully, I make it to Bristol. <laughs> Congratulations. Go celebrate. That team is pumped up. What a finish for Cole Custer, Mike. With a million dollars to the winner, NASCAR's all-star race brings up the best from the biggest stars. NASCAR Cup Series All-Star Race, live from Bristol, Wednesday at 8.30 Eastern on FS1. For more great NASCAR on Fox content, subscribe to our channel. It's somewhere right around here.